Now, a lot of Mainers are saying they're having a tough time getting an appointment for a COVID-19 booster or even an initial shot. Well, today the Maine CDC opened a new COVID-19 drop-in clinic in Augusta to help. News Center Maine's Rosalind Flaherty takes us there. Didn't hurt or anything. After having a tough time getting a COVID-19 vaccine appointment, Rose Irene Curl got a shot at the new drop-in clinic at the Augusta Armory Tuesday morning. I had a lot of nice friends and they kept looking out for me. And so and when they opened today? And when they opened this today, uh, they uh, called me right up. The clinic is run by the Maine CDC, Maine Emergency Management and the Maine National Guard. All three vaccines are available and there is no appointment needed. Pfizer, this is my booster, um, didn't feel a thing. A similar clinic in York County reopened early this fall, which emergency management officials say thousands of people have utilized. We reopened in September and we've done just over 11,000 vaccines. And to paint a picture of how much uh, the boosters and vaccine demand has increased, we've done about 3,000 in just the last week. York County's clinic is open for walk-ins three days a week on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Back in Augusta, the city says it expects similar results with many people not being able to get appointments for boosters or initial vaccines in other places. We've also gotten calls. People did get um, appointments and then they were canceled last minute or pharmacies were closed. City officials hope this clinic is the best way to help get people who want the shot vaccinated. In Augusta, Rosalind Flaherty, New Center, Maine. And police say people need to use the entrance on Airport Road to access the clinic at the Augusta Armory. That clinic is going to be open through at least the end of the year. And it will initially be open tomorrow from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m., Thursday from noon to 7 and Saturday from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. For more information, you can visit our website and our mobile app.